All right, guys. Uh, welcome back. This is episode two of uh, I don't know what the hell you want to call this. Uh, we'll call it New Hypes uh, Strats for Raid, and this one is Search and Destroy. Uh, this one's going to be on offense. Uh, just going over some of the things I think we need to cover. Um, as far as offense goes, I think that this is one of our better game types, and we could be really good in this. Now, um, what I think we need to do here is, uh, as far as flanks go, well, we'll talk about that later. All right. Um, what we want to get into here is we're going to, this, this game type is, uh, I was talking about it with Renewed, it's very mental. So we have to grind these out. Even if we get smoked around, we can't just put our heads down and let one go. I mean, we've you can come back we've seen it before it we've had it happen to us on teams that we were smoking in the beginning now uh, my first goal as an AR player is to check right here this is a great spot for picking up people check your that, timeline uh, actually I'm gonna plant the bomb real quick but this is a great spot for picking up people in both uh, open stairs and top laundry now <clears throat> Go to plant this. Uh, now, we Charges want another set. AR player, which I really love about this map. Rush in here, just like we're doing on hardpoint, but we want the AR up right there. So we want a guy rushing out here to AR, picking up people over here before they can rush raid side. Now, with this, you have you. This AR player doesn't have to worry about that and that right there because that guy's got him picked up so call outs are pretty easy here as we've got two players who can both pick up any of those sides right there and we should have a sub run inside right here so he's gonna straight at the raid so that he's got room to uh he's got room to maneuver down here now Good job, squad. I'll You're ready for the next round. Keep talking about that, I should have made the time limit more. But regardless, search and destroy. So that's that's the AR. Okay, so now um, eliminate the objective. We're gonna talk about the subs and the charges so acquired. We'll do and defense. We'll go ahead and do defense for this round too. But as a sub, you want to make yourself the least amount visible from ARs as you can. So the perfect route for this is like right here. So you, there's very little line of sight right there. And if there's a guy up there, you've got an AR picking him up right here. But other than that, you are not going to be touched as far as getting down into the raid, and you're going to be close. Now, this SMG player is most likely going to have the bomb. So he is going to approach the bomb from right here. So he's got an AR player over there watching his middle after, after this is picked up. So the AR player that was out here... Is checking this out now as soon as he doesn't see anybody if they are not defending B real well he's gonna check middle that's his m immediate responsibility he's got middle making sure there's nobody on open wall and nobody rushing middle that's his main goal okay so the SMG player runs straight from here now the goal on offense I think t should be to put as much pressure on the defense as possible so I think early plants are the key to this honestly because that puts you in a position where they have to disarm so we as long as we're defending we've got I mean a good setup here so this SMG as soon as he plants great spot times right almost up I know it's a fucking cheap ass spot but this is a great spot to pick up people coming out of the middle and coming from the side now the only thing he has to worry about is that flank over there but I'll let you know uh, why that's gonna be covered here in a second now the third SMG player or the second one I think needs to pop out here and help middle if they're pushing real hard defensively oh shit I'm gonna get blown up here we lost that round but it's not over yet get ready for the next one okay search and destroy now the third SMG player I think needs to be eliminate the objectives. He needs to be hovering bomb he acquired. needs to watch the flanks, the SMG guy. So he's gonna be here, checking here, checking here, make sure we're not getting flanked. Just checking back and forth. He doesn't have to get huge line of sights, and this is not going to be a sexy job right here. This is 
this is going to be an, un an unsung hero right here. But he is always checking flanks. So that's his job. Just bounce him back and forth. He needs to have dead silence on so that he's not getting picked up by the enemy. Now, as this player, uh, this AR right here, after a plant, and we've got guys on B side, now we're more than likely going to be a player down. I know how search goes. He needs to just check this flank right here. This is his job now, right up here, to make sure that nobody's flanking back this side. Okay? That AR's got that responsibility. This guy has uh, middle responsibility. Now, if we can get to where we need to be, if we can get a fast plant and everything, this AR, that sub still hovering back and forth in this in bottom red, this AR needs to move middle over there. So this AR needs to rotate, watching middle, and then this back right here in case that SMG goes down. So now we have a a premier setup for this. So we've got a guy able to watch pillars. We've got a sub double check his your pillars. timeline. We've got an AR up there watching that flank, and we've got a guy bottom red just causing chaos if we need to. Uh, this I think needs to be our main attack point, but. If not, it doesn't really matter. Now, uh, for the last 40 seconds, I'm going to talk about uh, defense on this side, and then we'll move to the other side, which won't take as long because I'm not a huge fan of that. But as far as Bomb defense online. goes on this side, um, I think we need to run somebody middle here. I think we need to go, or shit, we need to have two guys. Uh, I love doing an AR on the outside of this. Um, I, I think we could have two guys running here. I think this AR needs to run outside of here and check here, and then the sub just bounce off and come into here either way, like either way that somebody's not. And then the AR cover him, sub just kind of hanging around middle, because, I mean, we're going to find out quickly doing this which side, the, which side they're on. So if the AR and the sub get this far, then uh, they're more likely going A, and they can either flank all the way around. Or go good job. Middle, Get ready for the next round. How many players are down, and Able if they time. rushed anybody middle, or if they all rushed one side. Okay, Able now we're going to talk destroy. about defense on A, since we just covered defense on the other one. Able protect the so objectives. For A's defense, we have to have somebody right here. This is the easiest one to defend. Um, I mean. Obviously, you can just bounce back and forth. There's nothing wrong with staying up here. You don't have to push at all. I mean, you got control of everything over here. And as far as the sub goes, he needs to check middle. The sub on this side's responsibility doesn't need to be rushing the bomb over there. All his job is is to check middle. He needs to make sure that they're not rushing middle, okay? If they do rush middle, the SMG from B side has got to be ready to go help pillars. Okay, he's got to help pillars. Now this SMG, could, if they are rushing middle, he, it's a quick check. He's got to look and go. Okay, that's fine. If they're rushing middle, he's got help from open window on an AR position over here. So he's got help there. Now they might be in a gun battle. It doesn't really matter who wins. But if they are rushing middle, he's got a flank right here. He's got open window. We've got him in a crossfire if they're rushing middle. Because the we have an AR over there, and we have an AR, or shit, a sub on pillar. So we've got two subs in the middle on each side if they go middle. So we've got the middle covered even though it looks like we're leaving it open. But it's Mission this guy's responsibility, the sub, to look and make sure that... Uh, to look and see if they're going middle and if they're not he can hang out money room or if they aren't rushing middle he can run back into middle and flank either here or even go up here now this is an important spot this sub position is extremely important and it's got to be utilized to flank and the next round we'll talk about uh, offense for a good job squad get ready for the next round Search and destroy. Alright, this one is going to be... Uh, rushing A, in my opinion, Protect the is objective. a death sentence. But, obviously, in search and destroy, you've got to mix it up. That's just 
that's huge, honestly. If you go the same way every time, people know how to defend. I mean, there's good teams out there know how to defend both of them. There's not much you can do about that, so you've got to mix it up. Um, first things off, both subs, just go here and wait, honestly, because the first they are, now, you don't have to do this off the bat. Be very wary of that. Now, I think one AR on top. Watch an open wall. Watch in middle, okay? That's where they need to be. This is their responsibility, this top AR. That's what we'll call him. We'll come up with names with these. You guys make suggestions. That's perfectly fine with me. Uh, but, like, top AR, AR1, AR2. We'll just throw out responsibilities for each of these. But, either way, first AR needs to be right here. Second AR off the break. Now this is important. Off the break needs to come outside. His responsibility is outside, right there. That is this AR's responsibility. And if top AR gets picked off, he's right here. So we've got two ARs just mowing people down out here. Now both subs, this is important, both subs need to chill until it's a go from one of those two ARs that it's clear. And then we need one guy, one guy watching this, watching open wall, do not step up. You step up and get picked off and leave your flank open for A. It's then, too close. Fight I mean, harder. That's that's not what we want at all. I mean, do not be the guy that gets picked off right here from an AR player over there trying to pick up a kill in the middle because you saw a guy. Hold your flanks. That's very important. And then the other who has the bomb, give me a dolphin dive and plant. Yeah. And that's that's how we're gonna get a quick plant here. And as far as defending this, as soon as this AR player, bottom guy is done right here this is where he needs to be playing defense make sure we're not getting flanked and that's how we're going to defend it guys and the other sub i think needs to go tiki and chill out and i think that's how we're best going to win, operation uh, complete S &D nice job squad on raid let me know what you guys think suggestions are always welcome